now you see the whole picture is open. I paid with my life, I paid with my child's life and my family. For 10 years you threatened us and every time we moved you tried to kill us or threaten and you did. The three times we were attempted to be killed is all around your residence in Antwerp. The police of Belgium in the south and the prosecutor who write things, nothing of you is accepted anymore. Now I'm going to the next phase. Listen this very carefully and go public with this. The national governments have been aware of this misconduct by the Belgians, that they produce false documentation, Interpol documentation to arrest people, scientists or their families or pressurize them, as we've seen when people start teaching on the Cash Foundation, they make a threat, they're going to kill them, they, they go for their children as they did with Alex and the rest. If you are a scientist, and you've been threatened, or you're seeing that they're going to arrest you when you go back, get in touch with Cash Foundation immediately. There is a structure within the Interpol agreed internationally through United Nations, that you go on a specific site, you fill a specific form, and you can travel freely, that's the responsibility of the government, the port you live, and the port you arrive, at the destination point, your security is handed over, they cannot touch you anymore. It means any Interpol papers sitting in the office, falsified by the Belgian police, is void and not valid. Governments have started protecting their scientists, their businessmen, who accusation came through the monarchies of the Europe. I traveled through this for the first time to test it, and that's why we are in Dubai. For three years, they told us, if we move, they're going to capture us, and then we go back to Belgium and be killed. Our team, and we were told by the securities in Italy, they cannot touch, test it. We show you, we are protecting all the scientists now, we know the Belgians have started this. You don't know, get in touch with us, we tell you the procedure, go at security.keshfoundation.org and fill, send the message, tell us who you are, how you've been threatened, we know the name of the people who have threatened and they've taken most of your patent rights by threatening your wife, your children. We are attaining knowledge, who you are, what you are, we support you, you can move around freely to be free from the threats, and we'll take you to the safety of the Cash Foundation, one planet, one nation, one race organization. We give you room to develop your technology freely, and we encourage you and we finance you. This is why we set up one planet, one nation, one race. We are there to support you. You support and the scientists from Arab countries who have been on the run for a long time. The same, the scientists who are Europeans. They force you to hand over your uh, inventions against threats. Just write to us, don't worry. We tell you where to go, you fill in a form, and you go under protection of the United Nations and Interpol and you move into safety, where they cannot touch you. Security.keshfoundation.org is set up for partially for this purpose. The data will go directly to the security people, and it's for us to see how we can help you, and for us to move you, that they cannot intimidate you, or your family, or your children. We gather together, as world population, to start sharing knowledge freely, without being threatened at what they're going to do to us. We hear a lot of scientists being killed, intimidated. Now, the Interpol is onto them. The international police is onto them. They have no more control. And you will see a number of people in Belgium will go disappearing. But at the end of it, comes to one point. At least, we have united to protect ourselves, to to protect our scientists, to protect our children. We give you seven days, Red Circle, to come up with the children's 
graveyard name and address, where they are buried. Ask your bosses or the ones you arranged. The truth was a decoy, and everybody knew. We start meeting with the head of states, and part of us work is world peace. The other part is to protect our children. Without the children, there is no world to have a peace in, because there will be no nation. And our children are not your toys. God created women to enjoy by man, and God created man to be enjoyed by woman, at the age where they can consent to be able to share their lives. Children have no consent. In the writing of the guy which we released in the United States, it says, they wanted me, I release it to you, it's his own writing. She wanted me to abuse her. She gave her consent. You become so kaput in your head, that now you convince yourself the child allowed you to abuse it. It's in the writing of the man we release, we're going to release all the communications of him on the internet. The child of 10, 7, 6 allows the man to abuse him. There is 41 cases of sodomy with this gentleman in the United States. You are demented. Shame on you, Third Circle. How many children you buried with your own hand? You speak to the son of the king, who's a very good friend of you. He brought you to us, because you saw us a new technology. We are good, good bait for the children. Tell him, can you please, tell your dad, they got us. None of you will be able to travel any borders. We have made sure of that. Try to get on a plane and see where we're going to catch you. Please, if you're a Belgium and you care about your nation, and you're not a pedophile, and you care about the children we went missing, the Moroccan community which lost two children and they had to fight for it to get the bodies back in 1990s, we know what we are talking about with the Detroit case, go to London Tower, stand there and ask for the address of your children where they are buried. If you are anyone, you know that the children went missing, a scientist got killed accidentally on the motorway, the way it was explained to me by the guy who was who tried to poison me, he told me a few days before, a few weeks ago, that, you know the police are in just hit, and when you go on the side, then they shoot you, this is what they did for us, they told, he told me how they were planning to kill me, how they planned to kill me, and it didn't happen. And strange enough, he was the only one who saw a Belgian badge officer outside our house in Italy. So, the gentleman who poisoned us, He's another pedophile as part of the whole lot. We are adding this into the structure of the claim which is sitting with the European Court of Justice and with the Chief Judge in Italy. Chief Prosecutor of Italy is fully into it. And now other states in, in, in Europe have stopped taking position. Red Circle, you are a murderer. You've killed many children, or you've been the tools of children, the way you supported the guy in Antwerp, in United States. The minute we attacked him, you went for rescue of the friend, because you knew if he goes, you go. He's gone, now it's your turn. You pissed in my garden in front of my child, because you would have abused him, now satisfied. So, you're after the boys, not the girls, but maybe both, we have to ask your children. You wrote, I piss here and I piss there. So, for you, I wonder how many times you piss in your garden in front of your children and your wife in your sitting room. Or was it that's the reason she did exactly what the wife of the other guy in America did, put you out of the house? You don't play with children. Children are sacrosanct. Children are assets, children are our life and our future. And if you thought, because who you are sitting with is your right to do so, now we're taking you on. And all the group in Germany who are working with you, another bunch of pedophiles.
So, I'll give you a chance. Maybe I had to save your hand, that with your hand, you dig the ground and give the bones at least of our children back, that we can bury them, and the parents can rest in peace with the soul of the children. 1,000 German children, on the border between Germany and Belgium, where your king has palaces. I think you got the hint. Where Mr. Trude disappeared into. Because you all work on the same hymn sir. I thank God, I give your hand back to you. That you dig the grounds out and give our bones back, that we can bury our children. Over 300 Belgium children are missing. All buried in the gardens of the God knows wherever in Belgium. And you know most of them where they are. You've been at it over 30 years, sir. We don't make accusation. Now we got your chief. You brought your boss. Your boss is arrested. Is in prison talking. His computer confiscated it, and his supporter is already in grave, buried. They wouldn't even do autopsy. When a man dies, the first thing they do, autopsy. Man at such a high ranking, no autopsy. Because there was a biopsy. The biopsy was your Peter files. Give you a chance. People, Go to Belgium, go to Antwerp and ask for our children back. Put these on all the presses across. We gave interview to a very well-known chat show and they would not broadcast it because it would have damaged the elections in the United States. Election of a man to kill more is more important than the man who are killing our children with bare hand in raping them. I wonder if you had the stroke while you were raping a child, sir, Red Circle. The excitement at old age is not the same as when you're young when you do it. The heart can't take. I'm very clear, we are on to you and I will not stop. I got the first one and the second one. I'm going to get the whole lot of you. I'm not sensitive to pitifies, I'm sensitive loving children who pitiful accuses us being something wrong, protecting them. We open a channel for the parents who lost their children and we file. We file in European Court of Justice till all of you give your blood test. All of you go on a full test to tell us where the children are. And the head of the European Space Agency is not very far from. It's no use teaching, where are you use our teaching to lure children in to kill or rape. Antwerp, London Tower. A nasty number, number 13. The devil sits there. Protect your children in Europe. They are on the run, and people run on the run, they do any damage not to be caught. As I said, we opened the Cuba for the terrorists who blow us up. I address you, Your Excellency, Your President Obama. Open it up, maybe that's why you couldn't get it shut, to take all these people back there, these terrorists of children, and let them talk, at least we can find a grave of our children and we can put in a stop that people know is wrong. To them is normal. I piss here, I piss there, is something wrong with you. It's on the internet. Your Excellency, Pope President Obama, open Guantanamo Bay and take these people back there. These are the real terrorists. We know there is a discussion in White House. Carry it through, please, sir. These are the terrorists of our children and the future. You have two daughters. We have 3.5 billion children we need to protect. We'll discuss this deeply at every meeting with all the governments. And they know we are correct. Now, 
we see other heads will support this move. Going back to the teaching. It's not easy to change, but it's very easy to understand. Rick, can you bring somebody with the topic which you want them to discuss, because I'm ashamed to be a man. That we have to go, sorry to think. Okay, Mr. Kesh, um, perhaps we could bring in uh, Klaus with his uh, health unit, would that be okay? Please, Please go, go ahead. ahead. Okay, 